Here's what the scripture says when you feel guilty. Romans 3.21-31 Romans 3.21-31 says, But now apart from the law the righteousness of God has been made known, to which the law and the prophets testify. This righteousness is given through faith in Jesus Christ to all who believe. There is no difference between Jew and Gentile, for all have sinned and fall short of the glory of God, and all are justified freely by His grace through the redemption that came by Christ Jesus. God presented Christ as a sacrifice of atonement, through the shedding of His blood, to be received by faith. He did this to demonstrate His righteousness, because in His forbearance He had left the sins committed beforehand unpunished. He did it to demonstrate His righteousness at the present time, so as to be just and the one who justifies those who have faith in Jesus. Where, then, is boasting? It is excluded. Because of what law? The law that requires works? No, because of the law that requires faith. For we maintain that a person is justified by faith apart from the works of the law. Or is God the God of Jews only? Is he not the God of Gentiles too? Yes, of Gentiles too, since there is only one God, who will justify the circumcised by faith and the uncircumcised through that same faith. Do we, then, nullify the law by this faith? Not at all. Rather, we uphold the law. In Romans 3:21 to 31, Paul teaches us that the righteousness of God is available to everyone, regardless of our background or past mistakes. This righteousness is given through faith in Jesus Christ, meaning that we don't have to rely on our own efforts or good deeds to be made right with God. Paul emphasizes that everyone has sinned and fallen short of God's glory, but through God's grace and the sacrifice of Jesus, we are justified and redeemed. This means we are forgiven and brought into a right relationship with God because of what Jesus did for us on the cross. For us, this message is incredibly freeing and encouraging. It reassures us that our worth, and standing before God, do not depend on our performance or ability to follow rules perfectly. Instead, our relationship with God is based on faith in Jesus and the grace that He freely offers. This understanding removes any grounds for boasting about our own achievements and fosters humility and gratitude. It reminds us that we are all equal before God and equally in need of His grace. Moreover, Romans 3.21-31 calls us to live out our faith authentically. While we are not justified by the works of the law, our faith should lead us to uphold the law's true intent, loving God and loving others. This faith transforms us and motivates us to live in a way that honors God. As we navigate life's various challenges and pressures, this message encourages us to rely on God's grace, trust in Jesus' redemption, and live out our faith with humility, gratitude, and a genuine desire to follow God's will. Romans 3 21-31 Remember that, when you feel guilty,